Hello everyone! In this very short video we're going to review the CPU section of the Aptin report. In this case we run a test on an Android app, but the same applies to an iOS app. So in the test we run, we see in the summary section that the maximum CPU usage during the test was 84% at some point. We get a, a, a warning here because of the uh, limits, uh, thresholds that are already set by Aptin which is uh, at 70% and 90% uh, CPU usage, we will get a warning. So the CPU is a unit responsible for carrying out all the instructions of an application. This includes how to run different subsystems that keep the OS running, such as the multimedia, audio rendering, and more. When we scroll down to our resource usage graphs, we can expand the CPU graph and we can get more, more details not only about not, not only about the time that that max peak was reached but also how the cpu usage was throughout our test since the cpu is a shared resource abusing it might prevent other services that are also running to work correctly affecting the user experience as well as the prop, proper function of android uh, and all other applications that run in parallel to our app. So we have to be careful about uh, how we are actually, um, uh, how many CPU we are, we are using and is required by our app. In this case, we can see that at some point during the test, we saw that peak. We can then explore more what happened uh, during the test, but on average, the CPU usage was pretty, pretty low. With a higher number of instructions, the CPUs will increase its speed with a consequent increase in the use of voltage. And this causes the, the device battery will drain faster. So also we should be careful about uh, having a lot of these peaks in CPU usage or a, a high CPU usage throughout our test that will cause the battery in the user's device to drain faster and of course uh, have a bad experience.